in Britain, a nation often heralded as the cradle of modern democracy, a shadow looms over the fundamental principles that have long been taken for granted. Thousands of citizens are rising in concern as they perceive a distressing trend that points towards the erosion of essential rights and freedoms. As one of the world's most enduring democracies, Britain has long stood as a beacon of liberty, espousing the values of free speech, the right to protest, and the rule of law since the days of the Magna Carta. However, recent developments have cast these hard-won liberties into doubt, prompting unease among the populace and watchdog organizations alike. At the heart of the disquiet is a series of legislative proposals and governmental actions that appear to run counter to the long-standing tradition of British civil liberties. These proposed changes, according to critics, could significantly impinge on the rights to peaceful assembly and free expression, as well as potentially undermining the independence of the judiciary. The alarm is not without merit. Historically, Britain's unwritten constitution has been flexible, upholding a delicate balance between authority and individual rights. But the scales may be tipping as mounting pressure from various fronts tests this balance. Economic challenges, national security concerns, and political upheaval have seen policymakers propose measures that arguably curtail freedoms in the guise of public order and safety. It is a globally recognized truth that the democratic process is invariably tied to the health of its civil liberties. When rights such as freedom of speech or the right to protest are curtailed, democracy itself might be said to falter. This is the fear that stirs within Britain today. But why does this matter now? The world is in an era when democracy appears in flux, and the actions of leading democratic nations are under intense scrutiny. Changes to the status quo in Britain may set a precedent, either reinforcing democratic resilience or signaling a shift towards a more controlled and constrained civil society. The voices of concern in Britain are not lone cries, but part of a larger global dialogue on the state of democracy. The relevance of these developments stretches beyond the British Isles, offering a litmus test for democracies around the world. As other nations grapple with their own societal and political challenges, the developments in Britain serve as a reminder that democracy is not a static institution, but a living one, requiring constant vigilance to maintain. As Britain confronts the future of its rights and freedoms, the international community watches for the path Britain chooses may well echo far beyond its shores. This issue is not only a national concern, but a chapter in the broader narrative of contemporary democracy's resilience or vulnerability. The unfolding story of Britain's democratic health remains a topic of critical importance, and the world waits to see whether this long-standing bastion of liberty will stand firm or witness a retreat from the very principles that have defined it for centuries.